So welcome back everybody. Today we are looking at, uh, in the background, you've got the Into Darkness trailer and obviously we're using that to start a little discussion. We've got in front of it Ben Hawkins' uh, JJ Prize, which is obviously based on the 2009 movie, not Into Darkness, funnily enough. Um, but that would be a similar ship. I believe it's a refit, isn't it, in the, in the movie? Or is it just straight up the same ship? But we're going to basically talk about, um, you can tell me in the comments, guys. Basically, um, I've got four planes, Jordan 250 and Lego 8-bit. Got a number of Star Trek builders on today, but they're currently busy. So we're just going to have a little discussion about building Star Trek ships in Star Made. So if you guys want to take it away. I personally tried making a Star Trek ship in Star Made and, well, it didn't look particularly good. So for me, making Star Trek ship isn't easy and I admire the builders who make good looking and well working Star Trek ships in Star Made. Yeah. Because it ain't an easy business. <laughs> no, it's it's not easy making making spheres out of squares. <laughs> That's for sure. It takes a certain skill set and a mindset to do so. Well, I think the attention to detail trying to turn the, the, the all of the curves into those Star Trek because they've got really nice lines you know it can be very hard to yeah. pull that off but certainly people have managed it I mean there's one on the screen right now so um, that's probably one of the best scale examples that we've seen so far we've obviously had a number of others um, some prolific builders who have made almost the entire back catalogue of the Federation uh, fleet Enterprise E Enterprise E Gaia Sun uh, Seventh Durandal uh, Lego Assassin 57 um, I believe there's others. Obviously, Ethior was one of the early ones. He was with us from the beginning. He had his Akira. Um, and we've pretty much seen all the Enterprises made now. I don't think there is one which hasn't been done. Yeah, I did um, an Odyssey from Star Trek Online at request. Someone asked me to... Oh no, in fact, I made an Odyssey and an Avenger. But they were mini, mini scale, you know, so they were like 80 blocks long, very small, very small. Uh, so sacrifices were made in the curves. <laughs> but I think if you go for sort of 700 meters long, you're sold, you know, the curves work. Um, especially with this big project that we're working on currently. So, but you know what? I think we might have to revisit this discussion because we're running over on time now. So I think what I'll do is I'll cut together another fancy shot and we can do more stuff like this, discussing certain franchise builds in Star Made. If you like this discussion, then please do leave a comment in the uh, section below. And uh, thanks again once more for watching and I will see you all next time.